I'm in the acoustic corner, which is a place I used to stop when I, when I worked for Mission Hospital. I used to come here all the time, <laughs> and this gentleman here remembered me. Yeah, Tony, right? <laughs> the Tony. Yeah. Now, what's yeah. your name? David. David, and yeah. David, what's your last name? Zoll, David Zoll. And yeah. David, do you own the acoustic I corner? I do. I've been here for, uh, was here for 17 years, but I've actually owned it for like two. Oh, as man. Well, but. Yeah. So the reason I did this video, I wasn't going to do this, my wife's doing some shopping, but I love coming to this store because they have a really great selection of, of just, I mean, classic guitars and mandolins. You've got a cello over there, yeah. you've got ukes, you've got, uh, I bought my Larave here, uh, gosh, 15, 12, 15 years ago, it seems like it was. Whenever yeah, it was, yeah, it could have been, 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 been that long. Yep. And, uh, but at any rate, I wasn't gonna, you know, impose or anything, but he told me I'd come in and play, and, and he got these guitars called Eastman's, which I'd never played at Eastman before. Tell me a little bit about Eastman. Guitar. Yeah, sure. Uh, Eastman started actually as a violin company, is what they were. Um, so I think this is maybe the mid '90s, and so they started making archtop instruments: violins, mandolins, um, archtop jazz guitars, and they they've made steel string guitars for that long as well. But somewhere in the last six, seven years, they've just absolutely taken off. And they're just, just, yeah, they're absolutely so, okay, fantastic. Okay, so the guitar that caught my eye right off the bat was that, was this one right here. Yeah. Which is, is an expensive one, but boy, it's nice. Folks, this is, this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit a lick on this and let yeah. you hear it. Look how beautiful. And, and, and the thing that got me when I pulled it, so look at the headstock and look at the back back here. This, this, this makes me think a whole lot of my Martin D28. Mm -hmm. I've got a 71 D28 and it's like, that is nice. I like that a lot. So I'm gonna play that one in a minute, but tell us about these that are so affordable. I just got through playing this one, for instance, and this one was like 579 yeah, bucks. Yeah, so, so starting all the way to the left there, that dreadnought at the top, that's where oh. they start. That's their PCH series or Pacific 349 Highway. bucks. So that's a solid top, um, laminate back and sides, but you know, gig yeah. bag, but yeah. unbelievable for 349. No kidding. But probably my favorites out of any of them, are the E1 and E2 series. That's this yep. one and this one? Yeah, okay. the E1s, um, E1s are So this top. one's a Dreadnought, this is sort of a jumbo? Uh, or OM. A, oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah. they make it in a Dread and an OM or orchestra model. These are all solid. Uh, that's a different, that's yeah. another, that's a PCH2. I, I played this one and I liked it a lot yeah. too. It felt very nice. But I these it guys too. are there. They're all solid spruce, yeah. uh, sapele, or which yeah. is African Sapel, sapele, mm -hmm. <laughs> Killer uh, bone nuts and saddles yeah. on them. Oh, Ebony you. fingerboard and bridge. Come with a really, really nice gig bag. And they are, yeah, I mean, they're, they're, uh, 579 which for you know yeah. so it's basically kind of a D18 you know what a sound big sound so yeah it sounds huge yeah it really does it projects great yep yeah so for a uh you, you know, probably won't get that off this GoPro that I'm shooting this with, but that sounded big. It sounded like it sounded like my D28. Yeah. I mean, it does. Yeah, so I mean, for, you know, and as a longtime player, teacher, gigging person, yeah. um, this this is ridiculous. This this is like, for that kind well, of money, they're, they're so good. I'm a big fan of I'm, those. I'm tempted yeah. today. I have to, I have to <laughs> clear, it with the, clear it with the wife who's ever shopping at the hardware store, but so. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I just want you to see this. Listen, if you're in in Asheville area, if you're coming through Black Mountain, is east of Asheville, about eight or ten miles, and it's a great place. And this is in the beautiful little town of, of Black Mountain, one of my favorite places to come. Like I say, you got fiddles, anything acoustic is here uh, for just the the common everyday picker, and you got good prices and good people. So. Peace to all who watch. Subscribe to the channel if you like. I'm gonna jam just a minute. <laughs> so this one's this one's very nice. Tags on them. It's
This one is a $579 one. $579. This thing's pouring the right direction. This one's good. This one's a cutaway. And this one's 479. 479. that one. But it's, you know, the main so, one I think makes it very articulate. Uh, hard not to dig so that. Clear that is pretty uh, Eastman. Yeah, yeah. I see one of these in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not today though, but going forward. Oh, wow. okay.